What if we wanted to make something a little more realistic? If we look at some of the default sprites, let's look under costumes here, we can see that there's more than one costume. And what we want to be able to do is to create a sense of the walk cycle by getting the costume to change. So we can do that programmatically and also get Oscar to move from left to right. So let's come back to code here. So we want to be able to switch between the costumes. So the first thing we're going to do is do like we did before. We're going to set our starting point. And then we want to make sure that we start with the right costume. So make sure we switch to costume one. These are under the looks blocks. And then we're going to use the control blocks. So we use a, a repeat event. This time I've set the number to 20. And what we want it to do is to repeat 20 times, switching to the next costume. And then we want to switch to the next costume and then move an incremental amount. In this case, we're going to change X by 10 pixels. And then we are going to get it to wait before it repeats again by waiting 0.1 of a second. And this is experimental. So we'll, we'll, do, we'll run it through. Let's have a look now what's going to happen. Click on the go function. And it now looks like Oscar's walking across the page. He hasn't walked enough far enough. So obviously, if we wanted to change that, we'd up that from 20 to let's double it no, a bit much. Let's make it 30 and click on that. So now Oscar's walking fully across the page or almost make it to 35. And we could decide whether that was realistic or unrealistic by changing the, the, the wait duration. Let's double the wait duration to 0 0.2, the fifth of a second. Uh, and that doesn't quite work as well. It just looks like he's skipping. So the timing is the bit that you need to look at. But again, it's a really simple way of creating a or using code and using the costume switch. And this is the key thing to remember if you want to animate is that actually what you want to make sure is the costume switching is going to create that sense of animation. And then we're using the, the change values to um, make the animation look like it's moving across the page.